how to draw and make a beaver folding surprise step by step. Hey, what is going on everybody? So for the first step of our drawing today, we're going to want to begin by folding our paper. We'll first fold it in half, similar to a hamburger. Nice! Now we're going to flip our paper over and fold the top half one time. And once we're all done doing this, we're going to flip our paper back over to the other side. And we'll want to open this completely, so it should be laying flat. So for the first step of the drawing part, we're going to begin in the very top section of our paper. We'll first begin by drawing a small shape for the nose. This will be done in the middle of this piece. Next, to help make the mouth, we're going to draw two small curved lines that will be coming underneath of the nose, which will go down to the bottom line that we made by creasing our paper. And if you're new to the channel, then I just want to say really quick, welcome to Learn How to Draw Hub. We upload every single day, so if you're looking for a place to watch step-by-step -step drawing tutorials, just like today's video, then I highly recommend that you consider hitting the subscribe button. Now if you're all done with that step, let's continue. If not, feel free to pause the video. So for the next step, we're going to go right above the nose that we just drew together, and we're going to begin to draw the eyes. First, we're going to draw two circular shapes above the nose to draw the outline of the eyes. And don't forget to stick around until the very end of the video, because at the very end I'm going to show a picture of my drawing all colored in, so you can pause the video and match your colors if you would like to. Now we'll draw the inside of the eyes by drawing a smaller circle with a big circle connected to it. And we'll do the exact same thing to the right hand side. Now we will draw the outline of the head of our beaver. We're going to begin on the left hand side by drawing the left side of the face along with the first ear. Then we'll move over to the right hand side and do the same thing once we're all done with that step. Nice! Now let's switch sides. So far we're making great progress. For the next step, let's go ahead and connect those two ears by using a curvy line. And on the inside of each ear, I'm going to add in a small design for detail.
Great, now we're all done with the top section. Next, we're gonna to go to the middle section and we're gonna to begin to draw two teeth right beneath those two curved lines that are attached to the nose. Great job. Now we're going to draw the sides of the face. The sides of the face will connect to the hairy lines that are connected to the ears right above. And if you're enjoying today's video so far, then be sure to give it a big like so that we can continue to grow our community together. Now we're going to draw an outline similar to a square, but this will only have three sides. This will help us separate the sides of the face and the mouth. We need to separate this because the inside of the mouth will be colored in black, with the sides of the face being colored in a light brown color. Right below the teeth, we're going to draw a curved line to help make the tongue of our beaver. Fantastic! Now we're all done drawing the top and middle section. For the next step, we're going to begin to draw the hands of our beaver, beginning on the left hand side. On the inside of the hand, we can draw three lines to help make the fingers. Let's move on over to the right hand side and do the exact same thing that we just did on the left. Now just like how I added three lines on the left hand, we're going to do the exact same thing right here. Next we'll draw the outline of the stomach, connecting from the left hand all the way over to the right. To draw the outline of the stomach, we're just going to use small curved lines that are all connected. Next, on the inside of the stomach, we're going to draw a big curved line that will take up almost half of the stomach to help separate the colors. The inside of the curved line will be a lighter brown color. Nice! Great job! So far we're making great progress. Next, right underneath the body, we're going to begin to draw two small feet. The first foot that we draw will be on the left hand side.
Next, we're going to draw three small lines on the feet, just like how we did on the hands of our beaver. And if you have any requests for any foldable surprises, characters, or anything in general, then be sure to comment your drawing request down below, because we always read all of the comments. Now last but not least, we still have to draw the tail of our beaver, so on the right side of our page, we're going to begin to draw a tail that is connected to the body. Now on the inside of the tail, we're going to draw a pattern of lines going diagonal and across. We'll first draw one set of lines, all going one way, with the second set of lines, all going the other way. Nice! Now there's just one thing that we still have to do before we can call in our drawing. We just have to fold over the middle section just one time. Thanks for watching How to Draw Hub. I'm sure your drawing turned out great. If you'd like me to see your drawing, then share them on Instagram by using hashtag learn how to draw hub. And don't forget to give this video a big like and subscribe so that we can continue to grow our community together. Great job today. See you next time. Hey Learn How to Draw Hub crew. If you like videos like this one, then we highly recommend that you consider hitting the subscribe button so that we can keep you updated on videos like this every single day.